There are several reasons why you might want to restore a recovery image to your Surface Pro 4. One would be that the Surface Pro 4 is not working at all, it's not booting, the drive data has maybe been destroyed or lost. Another reason might be that you have an early revision Surface and you just want the latest 1511 version of Windows or later and you want the latest system image from Microsoft on your device and you don't want to go through the whole update and Windows reinstall process. So I'm going to show you how to restore a recovery image uh, using just a thumb drive. I would recommend you use a USB 3.0 drive. It needs to be 8 gigabytes in size. The first step is to download the recovery image from Microsoft. So I will put this link in the bottom of the video. But the first step is to have logged into your Surface with a Microsoft account so you can sign in and then you will see your Surface Pro 4 there. You can alternatively just enter your serial number and it will give you a download. Once you've downloaded this zip file, uh, you should extract it. So here's our file in the downloads folder. I'm going to right click and go extract all. I'm going to extract it in the default location. While that's extracting, we'll put a thumb drive in the surface. And our goal here is to format the drive as FAT32. So we'll right click, go format, and make sure you set FAT32. And I'm just going to call it SP4 Recovery. That way, if I look at the disk later, I won't get confused. Format complete. The next step is to take all those extracted files and we'll select all and copy to. We'll choose a location and we'll tell it to put it on that Surface Pro 4 recovery USB drive. And that will start the copy process. So we'll let that run. Now with your Surface Pro 4 turned off and the USB drive in, you'll want to press and hold the volume down key and then press the power button and hold it for a second till it turns on and once the surface sh icon shows up you can then uh, let go so you're going to choose English US and don't click use a device here you'll be tempted to click use a device but that's not what you want to do you want to click troubleshoot and recover from a drive. If you see this screen, it recognizes that you had some data on the C drive and it wants to use BitLocker to recover your files. Uh, what you want to do here is just click skip this drive and that will go to the thumb drive to try to do the recovery. Keep in mind as you're doing this, you will be wiping any data on your drive so be sure this is what you really want to be doing If you get a TPM warning here, just click OK. And the next part should be fairly straightforward. You're almost to the end. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to this channel. If this has helped you out, give us a thumbs up or a comment. And keep in mind, we still have the our type cover contest going on right now in the link on the screen. 
and thanks for watching.